What's up guys? Welcome back to Exactly Gaming. My name is Zach and today we are playing more World Box. Now last time we left off we got into a whole bunch of trouble with a lot of volcanoes, shot a lot of different stuff, had a good time. And this one I'm going to play around with some of the features that I haven't really messed with too much. Those being uh, kind of the big island creator. I I've done little versions of it in the past but I want to see what I can do with just like making, I mean, I've, I've done kind of the tiered stuff, but I want to see like if I can make like a cool, maybe, uh, you know, yin yang symbol and see if there's anything that I can do with that and make a cool little island, see what's going on. So I'm going to try to get rid of all the life and all that stuff and all these probably little animals and stuff that have spawned in. Make sure we have a nice blank canvas to work with. All right, so let's jump right in and get in that island creator. I like the big yin yang symbol. That would be cool to make like a, can I change the size of it? No, maybe not, we'll see. Okay, so that's as big as I can make that apparently. That's okay, so what if I do a skull? And now a star. We'll just do one of each. Oh wow, that's see, that's a big one. Why is that one so big? Oh, do I have to like stack it so it's actually like above ground level here? Well, that's I don't like that. Undo. I don't want that. I want. I liked the little idea. That was cool. So let's see about the heart. I think the heart's going to be big as well. Yeah, see, that's so big. So we'll do a big heart and a big star. And I guess i got to put some grass on there. Because it's being all weird on me. Yeah, I don't like that. No, we're just going to stick with the little ones then. If it's not a little island, I don't want it. So maybe we'll make it like a versus. Maybe we'll do Skull Islands versus these guys. How big is this? That's interesting. But we're gonna stick with regular, I think. We'll we're gonna do these islands. I, I don't know why I need such a big world to do this in, but hey, we got it. So working with what we got. Wow, these are small islands. I underestimated how small they actually were. <laughs> we might end up needing the bigger ones. Who knows? First things first. You know I gotta get the fast spawn and the sonic speed. We'll do humans here. We'll do elves here. And now let's give them, I mean, you know what, I gotta make it something. I gotta give them something. So each of them get one of these just attached to each island. So they still have their their root, you know. They still represent, but they each get a little thing. We got it. We got to keep it interesting somehow. So, got to give them something, or they'll all just die. <laughs> and now I'll give them all like a stone, and maybe like a gold. It's a gold. Are the people already dead on these? Come on. It took me a little bit, I guess, because I had to do the L's first. So I gotta make sure everybody lives. Gotta be fair. One iron for everyone. 
Iron for everyone. Iron. All right. Now, volcanoes on either side, just to symbolize the fact that this is a war. A volcano behind each place. Gotta have it, I gotta add some flair here. And now we're gonna make it a mountain, like, yeah, they're gonna be, like, surrounded by this mountain that keeps them. Oh, wow, I destroyed that volcano completely. We'll do that on both sides, then. We'll keep it even. All right. So this mountain surrounds them, and then outside of it, we'll make it just, we'll make, like, a little nice area. We'll do this, and yeah, it'll be just wonderful outside of it. How about that? And this will be the ocean. And then we even have, like, shallows. Like a beach over here. Yeah. That just really kicks ass. And, well, I'm just going to let them do their thing. Well, in the meantime, I'm just doing this. I think one of the islands... Oh, no, they're doing okay. Well, they're, I mean, okay is a relative term. They're, they're dying off, honestly, it seems like. There's three of them left, so. This area seems to be doing okay, though, so that's good. That's good. And then we'll have some close ocean over here before it gets real deep. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay. Now, let's get... All this rained on. All right, now we'll get some forest out here. They have enough space that so we can do some forest. Well, we'll spread it out. We'll do. Same style here. Alright. Get some more rain down on these bad boys. Alright, get some seeds. Let's do it. Yeah, let's see what this place looks like. This place looks crazy prosperous. Oh, yeah, that's just absolutely gorgeous, kind of. So. We are just going to sprinkle stuff all over the place here. And just make it truly beautiful and perfect. All right, let's check on these guys. So 18, so they're popping back up. All right, these guys are, wow, these guys are thriving. And we're going to leave them to it, and on the outside is going to be dwarves and orcs. Bunch of dwarves over here. Bunch of orcs over here. And then we got humans and elves in the, in the middle. So, we're going to see who does what. Wow, they're spreading out fast. That's kind of crazy how fast they're spreading out. Oh, oh, oops. I put a bunch in there. Didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that. got to get rid of them, kind of. Yeah, sorry, I didn't want to do that. I didn't want you there. There we go. That cleared out most of them. I think some of them are going to swim inland, yeah, but... We got most of them. We cleared them out, so that should be fine. And just to make sure everybody knows that this is a no-no area. We're going to make this nice and just war-torn, blown-up looking. Yeah, I like that. Now, what can I... Yeah, I need to crank up the... This place is going to be infested with piranhas.
I want this to be a very dangerous area. And the way that I do that is I fill it with piranhas. I'm sure thinking, Zach, wasn't wasn't it enough to just put them on islands and give them very little resources and then put volcanoes and then surround them with a mountain? No. No, it wasn't. So, what next? What 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 terrible thing can I do to these people? How will the will the they will just these piranhas are gonna decimate a turtle, won't they? Yeah, that's sad. That, oh well, hey, it got on land, so maybe I can just overload this place with turtles. See what happens. E one of each of their islands gets a turtle influx, and we just see what happens with an island full of turtles. Well, the piranhas keep coming for them, and then they run. So I've created an interesting little. Terrible, terrible reality for the turtles, unfortunately. What if the what if on the outsides of the volcanoes it was just bandits? That's fun. Yeah, there's stone bombs. I like that. That's good. And these people need a threat though. They need some kind of reason to not be doing as well as they are and I think that that reason might be demons you know I think demon wow these cities are doing incredible but the demons will come for all and the demons they do not discriminate wow this city's beautiful they got a coliseum here this place is looking fantastic too bad the demons are coming to kill absolutely everyone and destroy the Colosseum. You know, that's just the way demons are, guys. I didn't put the demons that... Wait, no, I did. I did. Never mind. It's my fault. I'll take that one. Ooh, what happened here? Oh, the bandits probably blew them up. That's fair. Hey, these guys are still... Wow, it's crazy how many piranhas they've cleared out. Maybe that was part turtles, part bandits? I don't know. It's gotta be. Hey, the bandits are good for something. Sand spiders? I want to see what these guys do. Oh, that's weird. Yeah, we'll leave that. That looks freaking weird. Well, well, yeah, let's clear out the middle part of it. That way, like, the boats can still go through, kind of. And now I think that we're gonna we're gonna clear out the middle. You know, well no, let's clear out the outside. The middle's done well. The outside's thriving too much. They defeated the demons. And they're rebuilding in the wake, but you know, I just think it's not fair and I think we gotta sarbomba them. And it's not just because I really, really want to, even though that's the exact reason. So let's do it up. Oh, yeah, there we go. Beautiful. Oh, wow, so beautiful. Well, guys, you know, that's... It turns out they can thrive. They can thrive and survive. And everything kind of works itself out. You know, the... The volcano bandits, they kind of fought back the piranhas, and now they can boat around, and it looks like the elves are not doing so great, so we'll clear out their little island. We'll leave their one island left, and the people, you know, I think that it looks like the, the humans, in the end, were, were victorious, so... We'll call that a victory for the humans, and next time we will we will see what else we can mess with. So I appreciate it, guys. If you did like this, and be sure to like, subscribe, really appreciate it. And bye bye, elves. I will see you all next time.